17, there was only one NFC wildcard spot up for grabs. The Minnesota Vikings, with their new $84 million quarterback Kirk Cousins, could win at home against the Chicago Bears and secure that spot. If they lost, then it would open the door for the Philadelphia Eagles to make a return to the postseason. With the Vikings controlling their own destiny, they blew it, and the NFC field was officially set around 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Both the Seattle Seahawks and Dallas Cowboys entered Week 17 with pretty much nothing to play for, so both found themselves in battles for pride. Now those two bruised and battered teams have to face each other on not even a full week of rest in the NFC wildcard matchup. The Dallas Cowboys are one and a half point favorites with their money line at minus 130. The total on the game is at 43 points. The Seattle Seahawks win or lose were a wildcard team and still decided to go all in against the Arizona Cardinals. A challenge with the Cardinals and head coach Steve Wilkes in his final game as head coach accepted. Four quarters later, Seattle had won 27 to 24. Toss out the stats, Russell Wilson hit a new level of play this year. There are at present only seven legitimate franchise quarterbacks in the NFL, and he is one of them. The fact that he and coach Pete Carroll willed this undermanned team to the playoffs should not be overlooked. Aaron Rodgers couldn't do it in Green Bay, but Wilson found a way to do it in Seattle. The Dallas Cowboys did at least sit Ezekiel Elliott in their season finale against the New York Giants, but they still played to win and picked up that 10th victory. The Giants didn't make it easy as Dallas won by just a single point, 36-35. The Cowboys are bringing the second best defense to the NFC playoffs and an offense that they can finally know how to use. Seemingly head coach Jason Garrett's head is off the chopping block, but an embarrassing showing here at home could change that. The Seattle Seahawks are 10 and 6 straight up, having gone 9, 5 and 2 against the spread and 9 and 7 on the over under. The Dallas Cowboys are also 10 and 6 straight up with an 8, 6 and 2 mark against the spread and a 7 and 9 mark on the totals. With Ezekiel Elliott on the field and Dallas at home, it is just too much to ask for Seattle to keep this train moving. Our pick and prediction will be for the Dallas Cowboys both straight up and against the spread at minus one and a half. The smart bet on this game is the Dallas Cowboys at minus one and a half points. If you make your smart bet with BetDSI.com today, get more sports fans will double their money with a 100% deposit bonus. That means that your $50 deposit and bet today at BetDSI.com could return you a total of 200 bucks. And that is the smart bet for this 2018 NFC wildcard matchup. Don't forget to visit GetMoreSports.com for more smart bets and how to make the most of the fun and excitement of betting the NFL playoffs.